What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. And uh, we're doing pretty good with this whole video thing. Uh, I'm done working overtime now, so should have more time to get some stuff done. And I think I have something pretty exciting today. Let's get a warm start. <laughs> I can freaking put the key in. Oh, I love the way this thing sounds. Right, so right now we are on our way to the shop and then I will kind of get into today's video. But before it starts, I won't take long. Uh, I just want to say thank you for all the support again and uh, keep Keep blowing it up, uh, keep dropping likes, whatever, or dislikes, you know, at least give me feedback, let me know. And uh, like I said, thank you guys for watching, and make sure you guys subscribe because I'm planning a little giveaway here shortly. At the shop now. I don't know if you remember what wheels were on this car, um, but they are off now. And if you watch the other videos, you'll know what wheels I'm talking about. But it is time to kick these police steelies front back and put something new on. I don't think it'll look too bad either. This video short, sweet, to the point. Out with the old and in with the new. Gotta take these off too. And I don't have any power tools so I have to use a ratchet. So I'll just keep doing that. Uh, impact uh, both batteries are dead and I can't find the charger so anywho we're still gonna bang this out I gotta pull all four wheels off of this and I have one wheel on the crown big right now and you guys just have to see it anyhow I'm just gonna keep ripping the wheels off this and put them over there and I couldn't pull it in either for other reasons so uh, this is probably one of the more uh, time involved wheel swaps but anyhow I think it's completely worth it and uh, I'm thinking about just throwing the steelies on this. It's gonna look ugly, but it's broken. So who cares, I mean, it's not going anywhere. All right, I'm gonna get back to it. First it started raining, uh, but I realized that these wheels uh, don't fit. I had, an, I, I, had a, I had a thought that that would happen. Uh, my friend Joey's gonna drop off stock Genesis wheels. Uh, so in the meantime, I'm just gonna finish up swapping over the fronts and then we're gonna get to the backs. All right, so I got one jack underneath this front end, and I actually have another jack, so I could probably take the back wheels off now. I was gonna wait and throw the stock wheels that are coming back on the front, and then just use that in the rear, but we'll see how it goes. Anyhow, so yeah, these are too big for the Crown Vic wheels. Um, I had a feeling they wouldn't fit anyhow, so we're gonna wait for Joey to bring the stock Genesis wheels over, throw them on, then I gotta take these rear ones off, and it's already night time, had to eat dinner. Uh, but then I'm gonna throw the rear wheels on and all these need air pressure adjustments and uh, I need to torque the lug nuts then. All right, got the stock wheels back on this now. So that's good to go. This isn't going anywhere anyways. So all four of the Crown Vic wheels are off. Stock's on here and we got the Cosmes XT006Rs on the Vic now. Obviously it's dark so I'm gonna have to pick this up tomorrow and that's where I'll continue the video on this.
just a quick walk around on the car, ignore the lighting. Uh, anyways, here's how the car sits. Uh, 18 by 9.5, like I said, Cosmes XT006Rs. I like how the fronts poke. I honestly think it looks pretty aggressive. The camera's gonna die, I gotta hurry up. We're, uh, we're in the middle of Hurricane Ida as well, so it is what it is. Here's the car, looks freaking great. Make sure you guys subscribe, comment, like, do what you gotta do. I'm gonna get back inside before it downpours another 10 inches, but there she is. Not too bad. So, more things to come for sure, and uh, especially with the Genesis. Catch you guys later. Thank you for watching.